again just wanted to make this a uh, quick video if you ever wanted to uh for your cpu to run at like lower clocks when you're just sort of browsing windows and uh, sort of you know watching youtube or stuff like that and you don't want um, your cpu to sit at like 3.7 gigahertz or something like this right um there's something you can do in um, windows power and sleep panel in settings power and sleep and then you need to go to additional power and um, if you're gonna select higher performance mode uh, then basically your cpu will be always running at 3.7 gigahertz and um, although it's not a big deal and the cpu actually runs quite cool uh, regardless of this um, it, it sits at like um, 40 celsius or even lower which is really nice um, you can do a little bit better if you sort of select like a power saver plan because then it will immediately um, put the cpu at a lower state and then it will uh, start consuming um, less uh, less energy basically and it will probably sit at lower uh, temperature over time but at least it will definitely consume less energy so if you're concerned about your uh, cpu just sitting there sort of doing nothing yet consuming like uh, 30 watts of power for no particular reason when it can do absolutely the same at like half of the same um, power level uh, you can do just yeah you can just go into windows settings select power saver uh, while you're doing just browsing and stuff like that and uh, it will immediately go to the lower power state um, which is pretty nice and I've noticed that Windows default sort of power saver mode is the one that sort of does the job um, I created my own custom power plan it's absolutely the same as the power saver so it also works but well while while the balanced plans in from Ryzen or high performance, they all sort of leave the, the CPU running at 3.7 gigahertz in my case on uh, Ryzen 5 2600. And uh, this is just like, this is not necessary uh, while it just sits there doing nothing. So if you ever thought how to downclock your CPU without like messing around with voltages, with like, um, with something like uh, Ryzen Master program or something like that, you can simply do this by um, you don't have to do any of those like so, sort of settings. You don't have to like manually uh, select your cores and whatnot. All you need to do is basically just click the power saver and uh, boom, your CPU in the power state. That is way lower, like at least twice as um, low as the normal or high performance one. You can and you can see that if you need the power, you can very quickly um, just sort of click on this uh, on high performance, right? Uh, and then you will get immediately all your power. It switches, uh, it uh, stays very very quickly. So yeah, this is just a quick video uh, for you to if you ever wondered like why your CPU always sits at 3.7 gigahertz while you do pretty much nothing. Well, this is how you can do it. Hope it helps, and uh, if it does, please um, subscribe to the channel, leave the like, and uh, share this video with somebody, you know, who might need this information. Okay, thank you, and take care.